everybody, Catherine here. And uh, I'm commuting in the train today as I'm uh, sharing my latest thoughts with you. So hopefully you can hear me okay. Um, this weekend I've been uh, reminiscing on the idea of not knowing and how a lot of us actually feel really bad about not knowing what we want to do next, where we want to go next, uh, what we want to purchase next, Being, uh, do we want to move to another country, whatever it may be, we do not know. And not knowing makes us feel like really um, disempowered. And I'm here to tell you that actually it's the opposite. Not knowing is a beautiful way of just surrendering to what the universe wants you to be doing. And um, the way you can do it is to switch your perspective that not knowing uh, from not knowing being a weakness to actually celebrating that not knowing is you opening yourself up to the unknown and that not knowing gets you into a place where you're totally open to receiving whatever happens your way and you're also giving up this idea this false idea that you're in total control of your life yes you're the ones making decisions and, and making choices but there is also an element of um, humility that you can bring into your life which is that you're actually doing the work that um, the, the universal energies wants you to do the work that was written down in your soul contract even if you don't quite remember it yourself and so I just invite you today and in this coming week to enjoy not knowing as a as some, as almost like you're as your spiritual development and to celebrate it and to rejoice in it and to simply be curious as to what is the next thing that will show itself that will be good for you. All right, have fun with it and uh, leave me a comment below. I would love to hear how you go with that and I'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.